Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. This month, Pope Francis asks us to pray for a spirit of peace and nonviolence. What does this mean? It's not just an absence of conflict or war, but rather an effort at resolution. Pope Francis writes, Jesus marked out a path of nonviolence. He walked that path to the very end, all the way to the cross, whereby he became our peace and put an end to hostility. Jesus chose to heal others, sometimes reaching out, even putting himself in danger so as to bring parties together. We need this spirit of peace in our wider world, but even as simple as something, let's say, kids on a playground. You know, there is a joyful way that children can cooperate together, help each other, and reach out to those in need. That's a good lesson for kids, but also for us big kids and on the bigger world stage. Dear friends, this month, let's pray and work for peace and nonviolence in our lives and in our world.